Wednesday was the 14th. Today is the 15th. Today is Thursday, April 15th. Uh, I'm headed into work. I didn't go the last two days because we couldn't leave our yard because of the snow. And the roads were really, really icy. So we, so I stay home. It was actually really nice. I love staying home. And I had some vacation, so I was able to use that. Um, the roads are a little bit better today. They had some melt off yesterday it got warm enough uh it's minus two now so that's good we're on the up and the snow will start melting probably today once the sun comes out it's 8 30 today it's 8 30 a.m i start at 10 30 uh, i have some books to drop off at the little library um i also have to go to the bank and put in a check but today i wanted to talk about goals with you um so I have some lofty goals that I want to do and I think a lot this year will hopefully change for the better. Um, right now, uh, it'll be next week, uh, I will be selling my steer. So my cow had a calf and it was a bull calf. You take the nuts out, it becomes a steer. And so I sell him this year. Usually you don't sell him till the following year so you can get some weight on him. Now this is a lot of information you probably don't care about. But anyways, I'm hoping to get $1,500 for him. And then the, <clears throat> excuse me. So out of that $1,500, if I get it, um, roughly 300 to 400 of it will go towards a new laptop because I really need a new one to write on, to edit videos, uh, I want to make planners. I have one up right now, um, Link links will be in the description. Um, the cover sucks, I need to do a new cover. But I want to be able to do that and I need a new laptop. My old Toshiba, she's not good enough for anything. Um, I also am going to buy a new video, video editing software for the fact that um, the one I'm using is Windows Movie Maker, which literally has nothing to add to it. So that is one of the things that I want to purchase and a ring light so that I can make better content and videos in my darkened room. <laughs> Cause she's dark in there so that's one of my goals and then the 1100 will be put away because my other side loftier goals are I want a tiny house really really bad or to buy a house in general um, I, I want to move for sure oh there's a porcupine out there a little, a little bugger um, yeah I want to move I currently live at home because I have too many goats and too many cows and too many horses and you can't take all that to town um but yeah i don't want to live in saskatchewan anymore i want to go somewhere else but you need money to do that so we shall see with that being said i want to hit a thousand subscribers on both of my channels um i'm at 516 on my other channel which is really exciting i'm very very excited and proud of that channel and I'm hoping what little income I can make out of there can be put away to then turn around and achieve some of my goals. Um, then my other goal, or my last goal, well actually that's not, that's not true. Um, one of my other goals is to quit my job for the health authority here in Saskatchewan. And then I want to become an author. Um, I've already did one planner. I'm working on a book right now. Uh, I am 42 pages in, I think. No, 41 pages in, I think. And I'm really excited with the way it's going. Um, it takes me a little bit longer because I'm a pantser. So if you, a lot of people don't know what that is, a pantser is basically you go by the seat of your pants. Um, I find if I start mapping it out too much I don't have any fun and then I lose sight of the end goal of that that's why I have a pile of books on the back burner that I've writ started writing and haven't gone anywhere yet so I want to eventually finish those but anyways one of my goals is to be an author so 
I'm going to, another goal is to publish my first romance book, because I read romance, that's what I read. I do like a little bit of fantasy, I love mystery, that kind of stuff. Uh, it'll be my first book I ever published, so I'm going to go on and say that people are probably aren't going to like it as much, because you got to write it and put it out there to learn to grow. So... Once it's done, and I've edited it at least two times. Edited it? That's not even a word. I edit it. That sounds funny too. Anyways, um, I get it completed, and then I publish it. So then, yeah. Um, the book I'm currently working on leaves me the option with at least one second book to write for it. Possibly two. So it could be a three part story, but they'll all be written as standalones. <clears throat> Cause I just find standalones are a little bit easier and then people don't have to read every single one if they don't want to. They can pick their favorite one, the one that's most exciting for them and then they can read that. So yeah, that's a little bit of my goals. I'm, oh he's got cows up. I'm really excited to hopefully see what I achieve this year um and then the other very last one I guess would be work on myself um I need I'm a negative Nelly if you want to say it that way I need to be a little bit more positive a little bit more uplifting but I'm very easy going like generally I'll go with the flow if if it suits to whatever it is otherwise I can be absolute crank but I think a lot of it has to do with the atmosphere we're currently in with my job it's not a fun place to be so you could try and come in positive and then crap hits the fan and then you just become sour and like it's a very souring environment that's one thing I've learned about my job being at it for 10 years is it's a sour place and it just chews on you the longer you're there so I have to make up the money before I can quit because I right now currently have a truck payment it is $400 bi-weekly so some days it's 800 or some days some months it's $800 the next one it's $1,200 that you got to come up with and currently right now I can't afford it I should have it paid off by the time I'm 32 so I'm 20, I'll be, I'll be brutally honest with you here. I'm 27, <laughs> 27, I still live at home and I feel like, I feel like I haven't accomplished anything cause I still live at home. But that's beside the point. Um, I chose to have animals and I chose to do stuff with animals. So it is what it is, but yeah. I need to come up with the funds to pay off my truck, let alone be able to put money away. So we'll see how this year goes. I'm so far, I'm very excited because one of the, my goals was to produce a planner. I produced it. Have I sold one? No, <laughs> not a single one. And you know, that's okay. Sometimes you ain't going to sell nothing and sometimes you'll sell billions of them. It just depends on what people like, if it intrigues people, help. I buy books the same way. I'm generally a one, like I'll only buy the authors I know and read. And then I usually will buy cheaper books somewhere else because I don't, I wouldn't try them in the store because I don't want to waste the $20 and be like, I ain't going to like that. So that's, I understand that it's hard to get into and sell books and that kind of stuff, but I'm going to try. Um, I think I'd be really happy being an author. I think it's something that would bring me fulfillment. I've always liked writing stories since I was in high school. And I've been reading since I don't even know how long. My first books were, and I always say it, I probably said it in my other videos, was a Lindsay Sands. Um, I think it was The Accidental Vampire. The other one was Gina Showalter's The Darkest Night. And Karen Rafter. Karen Rafferty's I Do Again. I have two copies of those. And I absolutely love them. And I think that's a lot of reason why I read the consistency I do. Um, I try and generally read one, if not two books a day. If 
if it's feasible. Um, sometimes it's not because I work like today at work. I will. I don't think I'm going to read today for the fact that I want to get a few more pages in. I might read the last half from my 6.30 to 7 o'clock when I'm done my dishes and everything's cleaned up and I'm just waiting to go home. I think I'll read from there. But I want to really sit down and get some words in. Like, I want to at least have this book figured out, published, everything by October. My birthday is October 9th, so I think that is my goal, is October 9th is my day that I want to get this done. But anyways, it's been almost 11 minutes, so I'm going to quit jabbering. I hope you guys like, comment, and subscribe. Definitely let me know what you want to watch in the videos. I, I, if you like these where I just talk and drive, I can definitely do a lot of them because uh, I work a full-time job. <laughs> so I'm always in the vehicle. I'm always driving. Um, I'm always going somewhere. But yeah, definitely let me know in the comments down below and I will see you guys in my next video. Thank you for watching and have a great day. Bye guys.